Two Metro police officers defending their use of force in court today. The officers are charged tonight with battery and official misconduct for using baton strikes against two women back in May of 2020. Our Rich Nye was in court today for the officer's testimony, and he joins us live tonight from the Marion County Community Justice Campus tonight. Rich. Scott testimony for the day wrapped up about a half hour ago. Now this case goes back to the May 2020 Black Lives Matters protest and the downtown vandalism in Indianapolis. Out of that, a grand jury indicted two officers for using excessive force in arresting two women for violating curfew. Now, most of this day was spent with the testimony of Officer Jonathan Horlock. That's him in the beard with the video in this video. Testi uh, Horlock testified that he only used baton strikes after he observed Ivory Westfield push away from another officer and then break away from his grasp. He narrated his actions as video of the incident was shown to the jury this afternoon. He says Westfield continued to resist arrest during the use of those baton strikes. You see Officer Nathaniel Shawrecker, who is wearing glasses in the video, he actually struck Westfield first with a baton. Now the two women arrested again were Ivory Westfield and Rachel Harding. The officer struck Westfield three times with batons and you can see in photos that she suffered major bruising and open sores from the arrest. The prosecutor decided not to file any charges against the women in this incident, but again, it's the officers who face charges of official misconduct and battery. The defense still expected to call a couple more witnesses tomorrow morning. Then we should have closing arguments and jury deliberations in this trial, Scott. And we know you'll continue to cover that trial for us. Rich Nye in Indianapolis, thanks so much for that report.